A year of television excellence has led us to this one very special occasion. Tonight, television's top critics honor Hollywood's finest. And as you can see at this very moment, TV's biggest stars are gathering to celebrate. The carpet is already buzzing with celebrities making their way into the International Ballroom at the Beverly Hilton Hotel for the 2015 Critics' Choice Television Awards. Hi, everybody. I'm Kevin Frazier, and welcome to the Critics' Choice Television Awards Red Carpet Live, which tonight is actually taking place on a blue carpet, but it's okay. Stay with me because we have a lot of stars here, and I want to say if there is one person, one actress who has been the face of 2015 so far, it's the woman standing right next to me, Taraji P. Hanson. You don't don't even try it. She is nominated tonight. Her show Empire is nominated tonight. What has this ride been like since January, when Empire really took over the world? Um, it's been pretty amazing. I mean, this is an actor's dream. I mean, this is what you work so well. This is certainly what I've worked so hard for. I mean, I've been doing this for 20 years. I guess. The bit of comedy for me is we talked about it earlier. It's like people are like, oh, she's the new girl. I'm like, new girl? I'll take that. That makes me about 10 years younger, so I'll take that. Let's not forget Baby Boy, Oscar nomination for Benjamin Buttons. Uh, you've been in so many things, Hustle and Flow. Okay, Cookie Lines is now a part of the American lexicon. It's What is it like playing a character that so many people love? It's bittersweet because obviously I'm doing something right. People are affected by Cookie so much so that they now call me Cookie. And that's the bitter part because I would like to be called by my given birth name, you know, Taraji B. It's so beautiful. It's Swahili, it means hope. But I guess I'll be Cookie. It's okay. Listen, you'll take this and the nominations, trust me. By the way, um, the show is doing so well, and a lot of people say that the Critics' Choice are a precursor to the Emmys. What does it mean to have the nominations here, and what do you think it'll mean come Emmy time, because so many people are making their votes right now? I really don't think about that. You know, I think for me what this all represents is that, you know, we're doing good work. I'm doing work that is affecting people and touching them in a way and moving them to want to vote for me and put me in the limelight. But I don't go home and go, hmm, Critics' Choice means Emmy's coming next and the Golden Globe means an Oscar and you can't even go to the Oscars with TV. So it's just like, chill, just enjoy the ride. <laughs> there is no one I enjoy hanging out more than Taraji. Have a great- Another spa day. Another spa day. We had a spa day that was epic. We need another one. Okay, good luck tonight. We'll keep watching and congratulations. You've done such a great job. She is I'm so happy for her, and I am also happy to introduce my co-host for the night, the beautiful and wonderful Samantha Harris.